Umbi, like him and Walker, like, did they ever find it? Did they ever kill it? Who knows, really? Wow, this place looks like shit. <laughs> like bullets, arrows, wow. Hey, look, it's Ben. It looks like it's turning to fall, and that's unfortunate. There's Clementine. You're back. Indeed, I we found are. Some stickers in a drawer, and I put them on my walkie. Hey, sweet pea, that's neat. I'll find you in a minute. All right, she's such an innocent girl. I love Clementine. One of the honestly one of the best characters of this game. Looks like we got the kid on watch again. What'd you get? Might as well leave a sign out that says the men are gone. Come and rape our women and children. Huh. Why would you joke about that, Kenny? Your so, wife and your you child get? is here. A lot of stuff. We're fine, by the way. Yeah, thanks for asking, you this asshat. This will keep us going. If we carry on like this, we'll get through the winter here. The nope. winter? We'll freeze our asses off here. He's piling into an RV with you two. After what you did to my dad is so appealing. Then you can Why stay. Why wouldn't it be? You know, I'll do what it takes to keep everyone safe. We're already safe. Take a look at the wall, Lily. Mm. That's not graffiti. That's a good question. Those One or three. Holes. And we got enough arrow shafts sticking fuck? out of Why it not? to dry our laundry. We have to go eventually, Lily. We don't have to do anything. You didn't want to go because of your dad's health. But he's gone now. Easy, Kenny. Take it easy, bro. At it again, are we? Indeed, we are, Carly. Don't boss people around. I'm sorry. Somebody needs to make executive decisions for the group, though. And I don't think you're capable. <laughs> Everything can't come down to the same disagreement. <laughs> Stop that shit. Lily Kenny's got some legit points here. I'm so tired of it being you two versus. Damn it! Me. I'm not on anyone's side, Lily. These decisions affect everyone. Yeah, what Lily, you stupid situation? bitch. What about protection? What about when this place falls? Somebody's got to be thinking about this shit. How has this not been working? We have everything we need. Because of me, Lily. That's BS, Kenny. And you... We deal with shit as it comes, just like we always... Exactly, Lily. when 15 bandits hop over that wall in the middle of the night? Well... What then? You just gonna deal with that? <laughs> yep. Everything that happens to us is another excuse for you to pull this crap about leaving. All I want is a week of peace, of not hearing it. Okay. Do you know how we got these supplies? We got lucky and let a girl get eaten out there. What? Some girl came screaming out of an alley. She had dead hanging all over her. You know, the thing she is with this... Get everything we could out of the drugstore. Katja would still be re reacting. What? Like she would still be reacting the same way if we killed her. Anyway. Made the most sense in the moment. Lee's right. We've been putting our lives on the line doing these runs into the city. You wouldn't believe the shit we see. It's ridiculous. We all appreciate it, Ken. You should be thanking Lee for not shooting that girl. It's not so easy for him. Look, Macon and its Carly people just gave us that look. It's not a town. It's full of walkers. And the people who were left are dying and wandering out onto the streets. It's hell on earth. And it's coming. This way. Yeah. It's not going to be easier out on the road. How Shut up, you? Lily. What I know? I know you're not above murder. I know somebody has been stealing our supplies. That's what? right. Stealing, and I know the list of people I can trust here gets smaller every day. There's not many now people everybody here. Everybody get out. Ay, ay, ay. Um. She'll get over it. Yeah. She's riling everybody up otherwise. You understand, Ken. She's right about one thing. None of this is getting any easier. She really is right about that, though. Oh, things are coming to a head. Indeed they are. I say that. Well, I think you did good today. And I find myself thinking that most days. Thanks, Carly. Thanks. <laughs> it's probably worth following up with Lily about what she was saying about missing supplies. With her wound up the way she is, I don't want to see her paranoid. No question. And I'd like to talk when you've got a minute. Hmm. Now here's the good question. 
What do we do first now that we have it? Hmm. Oh, can we move? There we go. Let's talk to Clementine because we said we'd talk to her first. Well, we didn't, but we're going to talk to her first. Hey, Clementine. Hey, Lee. What's that you're working on, Clem? It's called a leaf rubbing. My teacher, Miss Moore, showed us how to do them when we were And a teacher named Miss Moore. She taught ones. me biology. See? It's the same. Ooh. Um, kind of. It's pretty good, now though. That's really something. I'll make one for you, too. Do you like it here? I don't like it here. Do you want to leave? Where are we going? Somewhere oh, else. <laughs> Somewhere um, else. Maybe if I knew where? Yeah. That'd be a good thing to know. I'll talk to you later, Clem. Okay. Okay, let's uh get the annoying bit out of the way. Let's go talk to Lily. No, wait. Let's talk to Ben. Odd question, but... No, fuck Ben. We're gonna go talk to Carly. We'll talk to Ben after we talk to Carly, then after we talk to Lily. <sighs> hey, Carly. Talk to Lily yet? No, not yet. Oh, shit. I, I forgot. I have to talk to Lily first. What I wanted to say was, I've been thinking a lot. Oh, <laughs> never mind. I think about you, too. There was some hesitation in his voice. I heard there. Our group is small. You're small. Oh. You're a convicted killer. Carly, Jesus. <laughs> and I think people should know. Not because they deserve to, and not because you're a bad man. I think the opposite of those two things. People need to know because we're hanging by a thread here, and I can't see Lily talk about you without thinking it's the next thing she's going to say. You don't have to tell everyone, but think about who you trust and take the opportunity while you have it. She has a very good point. You're probably right. I'm probably right. Of course I'm probably right. Of course she's right. People she's Carly. And telling them might cause some trouble, but it will be a far cry from what will happen if they don't hear it from you. Yeah. So you'll do it then? I'll let people know. You're totally right. And this, my friends, is the reason I saved Carly back however many parts ago that was. Aww. Don't call me small. <laughs> oh, God. Now, is there anything else you want to talk about? You really think people are ready to hear about But yeah, this is the reason I saved Carly. If you save Doug, the entire possibility of talking about Lee's past is completely out of the picture. And I need to do this because I want to maintain my relationship with Kenny. That's exactly what I need to do. Just to let you all know. Keep Kenny with us. We need to get on his good side, bruh. This place is fine, but we all know that that could change at any second. And she's right about that. You, uh, have any thoughts about Lily? I worry about her. That's about it. She keeps trying to run things, but it's just not working. Yeah. We'll look into this thing. Good idea. All right, later, Carly. Now, before we talk to Lily, we're going to go talk to the people I want to know about my past. The first thing is Clementine. Clem, I need to talk to you for a second. Okie dokie. Okie dokie. The day you and I met, I was in a car accident. I remember. Your leg was bleeding. The car I was in was a police car, and I was on my way to jail for committing a crime. Oh. I need to tell you now, because I don't want you to hear it any other way. Okay. Do you have anything to say? I don't think so. It's you good. Can, uh, go on back to your things. Later, Clem. I'm, I'm sure she appreciates. Yeah, she understands. See, let's tell Car wait, Carly already knows. Before we, let's tell Ben. Why the fuck? Why the fuck not? Hey Ben. What's up, Lee? <laughs> hey Ben, I need to tell you something. Surely, is it about my watch? I'm trying to do a good job. You're doing fine. I'm a, uh, I'm a convicted murderer. Whoa, seriously? Yeah. Why would I joke about that? I don't know. Um, 
Wow. You're a part of this group, and you should know. I've never met a murderer before. Well, I hadn't, I mean. I know what you meant. Ben, you Thanks are so stubborn. Thanks for trusting me, man. I, uh, I... Ben, relax. Okay. We're not gonna kill you, buddy. Oh, Ben knows. Well, let's talk to Kenny. It's, fi it's time that our big hey, man gets to know about How the secret. Doing? We're okay. Just having a little spat. That's good. We all carry guns now, and I don't like it. It's the way it's gotta be. I know, but I'm not getting used to it. I'm sorry. How are you, Lee? Kenny, you got a second? I need <sighs> to tell you something. Sure, pal. What do you got? All right, let's tell Kenny the big secret, my friends. It's serious. Oh, no. What'd the she-devil do to you? <laughs> Shut up, man. <laughs> I killed someone. Different than Larry or the St. John's. Different from everything. This was before the walkers. Uh... I know. I, I didn't say anything when I met you because I was with the girl and... You know, I, I was worried. I just smashed a guy's head in with a 50-pound block of salt. You saw me do that, right? Yeah. Yeah. There's a video footage of it on Are you YouTube. talking about who we were? The fuck does that matter? It's everything this mess has got us doing now, Lee. Shit. <laughs> Look, is Duck safe around you? Of course, of course he is. Then shut it. You don't owe anybody any kind of explanation. Well, at least he knows.